yeah, uh, I want to make a, a video, and a couple subscribers asked me about how I started my own company. And, uh, so yeah, so how I started my own company was I always worked uh, excavation uh, and, you know, land clearing, logging, stuff like that. Um, so I did that for a number of years with uh, a couple different companies. Um, the first job I had, actually, I worked at a sawmill, and uh, I caught I caught the uh, wood off the sawmill, a big 50-inch um, 50 50 blade, circular blade, um, and the sawyer would cut it, and, uh, you know, uh, I would actually load, load the locks uh, using the PBs, roll them down the runners onto the carriage, help the Sawyer uh, tighten the dogs down and all that and uh, then I'd go to the other side and then you know he would cut the cans, cans, boards, the slabs off the log uh, so I, I worked there for uh, a few years doing that and uh, loading loading the ramp up with the logs uh, on the logging truck and all that uh, bucking wood but then uh, I like the heavy machines too, so uh, I got a job um, laboring for a while, learned how to uh, lay pipe in the ground and uh, drainage and uh, started running machines and uh, loading dump trucks and then started, you know, uh, digging trenches and uh, digging foundations. So I really like doing that. Then I ended up getting my CDL license so I can drive uh, the dump trucks and stuff too. Um, so I was doing all that and I always wanted to, I always wanted to uh, have my own, you know, be my own boss, have my own stuff. So the way I did it was while I was working, I said, I, you know, I saved my money and stuff, but like the, how I started was, um, first couple years that my income tax return I took the whole thing and I saved it um, that first year I, I saved my income tax and I had some money saved so what I did was I my first machine was a skid steer Bobcat 743-6 skid steer um, I ended up get, finding, finding that through uh, somebody I know a friend of his and I ended up uh, having just enough and I ended up getting that. So I used piece of equipment. So then the next thing was I, I was able to get it uh, brought to my, to my house and all that. And I used it in my yard and everything. But the next thing I, I had a pickup truck, you know, already F-250, but I needed a trailer. So I, you know, I went and looked, of course, and I found an old and used trailer. So now I was able to move, move around truck trailer machine so I started getting so then I you know word of mouth and, and uh, things like that I started getting jobs on the side I would do jobs on the weekend so I always had my normal full-time job with construction companies but on the weekends I would go do grading um, all kinds of stuff with the skid steer and then then I noticed though a lot of people, you know, they want stumps removed, like because the, the bigger companies don't have time for the small stuff. So, so I ended up, so I went through that whole year, and then I saved the next year income tax, and I had other money saved, and I ended up getting a uh, Bobcat 320, 
another whole year of working on the weekends. Bigger jobs, and then I, 